You might have seen the rise of stolen cars, especially when it comes to bikes. Guys, owning a bike in South Africa right now, I can say, is one of the dangerous cars to own. One of the dangerous vehicles. Because this car, guys, this vehicle falls under top three of the most stolen cars right now. Even Polos, I see Polos are stolen, but when it comes to bikes, especially towards the Hilux, Guys, you know how they, most of them, they are very, very much stolen each and every day. You might have seen recently that the young kid's life has been taken because of this vehicle, because of this specific bike. A name of the devil called Juna Palane, a five-year-old in which was shot dead in social media, guys, by hijackers who were targeting his father's bike on the 10th of May 2024. It is alleged that the devil had gone outside to welcome his father from work. And unfortunately, a group of hijackers, they came by in which they were targeting this bike, this specific bike. And I think it was driving a Toyota Hilux. And the little boy got shot in the middle of the process, in which we don't know the reason because I was not even fighting with these hijackers. He was willingly so to give up the car. But guys, he got shot. Why? We don't know. Because the father was cooperating. The little child's life was taken so easily because of a the half a million car half a million vehicle 250 vehicle for that price little car little boy's child now he's gone the devil was rushed to the hospital immediately when they arrived he was declared dead he was declared unalive there's my um this is my eyelash man this is for my sleeve that's my canopy. This is it. Lift it out. All is out. Yeah. This is my relax. This is it. This is my relax. Okay. Seat covers. I'm going to get them in the stack. I'm going to get my relax in the stack. Yeah. So, that's my old licenses. That's my back here. That is good. The deer is not easy. That is the deer. This is my bumper. My winch. Seat covers. All is has been arrested so far which says a lot guys how come they have not arrested this criminal this IJ guys i'm not sure whether the highlights didn't have a gps or even a track because they were supposed to be gotten by right now guys so all i've seen is eff brisilin dozi was there gensin mckenzie mckenzie was offering 250,000 rent to anyone who who might have information about this IJ guys also the minister of police was there and guys it says a lot because how come They've, they've not been caged. They've been not been arrested. Guys, right now, I can't even speak. Even at the beginning of the year, there was this lady called Crazy Duplices. Her baggy was taken after three hours. After being bought at 5 p.m., after three hours at 8 p.m., it was gone. It seems like these guys, it was plain because after they've been bought, it seems like the, the dealership, they kind of followed here until his destination until they were relaxed they saw that no this is the good place to stay the car then that is how it was told even the criminals were spotted on the cctv footage but after that we didn't even receive any feedback of what happened but it seems like it has a planned robbery guys these cars are stolen very very easily the only feedback i got is this one that is no longer located in soweto but in the middle of the ocean going to the north imagine guys your car is gone forever also, guys, let me take you for a scenario of a guy who was also guys, in a similar situation. But he was not driving a Toyota Hilux, he was driving a GWMP series. We stay with him here, guys, at Gas. We stay with him. So, what happened is mostly he does his usual errands like selling, I think he says stuff, hearing by people. So, one day, guys, he was coming from work at night. They hijacked him. And what they hijacked him, they made sure that they put him inside the boot or in the cabinet. They put him inside the, the cabinet so that guys he doesn't call anyone doesn't call even the tracking company so after he was found after three days he was found after three days of being hijacked of being kidnapped 
and that car i'm not sure whether they found it or not but it was found after three days right now i can i can say he's still driving a bike but it's no longer a gwm pc series he's driving a mahindra a mahindra guy they call mahindra mahindra from hearing a lot of people they say it's good but you know it's ugly i don't want to lie it's ugly but you know guys they're saying it's good and obviously guys he's trying to evade these situations like this of being hijacked of being um his car being so attractive to criminals because this car is stolen very easily ford hilux isuzu gwm they are kind of appealing and they're stolen easy let me explain when it comes to vvti because most of these cars most of these toyota cars they use vvti even for tuna guys they used to be the stolen cars i'm no longer sure right now but right now it seems like Toyota Hilux is being stolen very, very easily. Usually at Toyota Fortuna and Toyota Hilux, they use D4D or GD6. And these engines can act as a donor to another cars, especially our daily transport, which is called a Quantum. Yeah, guys, I fear the Quantum in which it was fast and it was sounding insanely. All I can say is that engine doesn't belong there. Most of the other vehicles that are taken to neighboring countries, as guys, they can instead the African roads and they're in demand into the black market. So it seems like guys, most like going to Mozambique, Zimbabwe, Malawi, Nigeria. We have seen guys, very, very much higher value vehicles being transported or being sneaked into another countries, but they're intercepted. But if guys, ish, you have bad luck, seems like no longer find your car. So how can we prevent these situations from happening? by trying all means to evade these situations first of all like i can say try to have an anti theft especially when there's this product called ghost product i'm not sure what it does but i can say mostly before you start your car you must do some codes you must do some maybe if your code is uh you beep first and then you flash the lights then after then that is where you can start i can say try to have that and also try to have more than two trackers tracking company in your car and try to have more than two so that if this one fails the other one is able to track your car because the place's car she was using this company which is called matrix i'm not lying i'm not lying this is what was written she was using this company matrix then this company failed here this money because after a few hours they said it's in so way too after a few hours it's in the middle of the ocean obviously it's gone and the vin numbers from the door from this uh, windshield is gonna be erased totally so try to having these these things and some people right now they're locking their pedals try to have something that is gonna lock your pedal so that even if they are going to um, rob you or they even they're going to throw a grand theft auto on your car they cannot drive it they cannot drive it try by all means to have that locking your pedal number four the steering lock also try to have a steering lock because these cars we can't be affording to lose them easily and even Toyota i like i can say toyota these are uh, even the toyota brand it doesn't say anything and it must say something as about the stealing of cars even the bike is especially for these companies who produce bike is they must say something because it must know the hotspots there are hotspots in which hijacking Grand Theft Auto is happening, the stealing of cars is happening a lot, they must know. Let me name, let me drop name some few places like Benoni, Davidson, Soshanguve. I can say these guys, this is the place where, even Rotteport mostly lately, you might have seen uh, the player who passed on, Kerchief's player. He was also hijacked guys in Rotteport, so you must know guys, you must prevent, I can say be alert when you're going to these places because uh the table holders were shot at social movie so guys please be aware there was even this uh this person's bike in which was found in police station stripped the bonnet was stripped all i say guys right now is condolences to the family and guys please be careful and thank you guys for watching today's video catch you guys in the next video yes sir